Okay, we've finished up Big Boy here. Mr. Case Hatter. Been working on it. I decided to make a change. We were on the low end of the wattage per weight scale. Wattage, your power, your horsepower. So I went up a few watts, got her, got her <clears throat> a little closer to the weight scale, quite a bit closer actually. We're pushing 950 kV at about 300 watts, 325 at full throttle. Now I got a little cavitation with the mount, so I added a couple of barbecue skewers tied into the main spar and attached them up here with the the Dacron fishing line and glue worked perfectly held them in place uh, we got her ready to fly we're going to there's your metal skewers oh, barbecue skewers and your fishing line going across And actually this motor's just held on with one screw at the top and the bottom screws and top screws keep it from slip. The actual force against it, it's not going anywhere. We can put a little lettering on. B6S. And of course I fly Fataba, so I stuck Fataba here and there. I got Battery hatch with a push pin on the side to make sure it don't come open even though I can't hardly get it open. I put my Velcro on the bottom and I have Velcro on the bottom of my battery so when I put them in they'll stay put. I'll be running four cell with this motor. Two four cells and one three cell. All 2200 milliamp, and I got my little pocket spy cam here. So, the next thing you'll see on Mr. Case Hatter's channel will be the maiden flight of Big Boy. A little spy cam here from hobbyparts.com. Alright. <clears throat> added the, uh, the vort wing vortex for a little nice little writing on them. Gentleman Jim Fataba. So, this is a big boy. Hopefully, after the trip to the field, it will still be in one piece. <laughs> Only time will tell. It's time for the excitement to begin. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and keep up with the flights of the big boy and others. As my camera ability improves. Thank you.